Oh my, there seems to be a burglar in town. Hello everyone. It is me, Cody Norbit, and I'm here with Maya, who is asleep. And today is her birthday. She is 34 years old today, on two, today, April the 3rd. So today we are going over to my sister-in-law's, Elizabeth Corman's house, and we are going to celebrate her birthday. We have been over for visits, but yeah, because um, we live really close to them. Because they just live right over there. So yeah, what, um, that was a bit loud. Her mother is making their kids breakfast, and yeah. So yeah, we have been here about six months. No, Maya is six, Mila is six months. She's almost seven months. She'll be seven months old soon. So we've been living here for almost eight months. Wow, because we moved in right before Mila was born, but yeah. Um, and we are liking it here in this apartment. It is just a little small at times since her mom has to sleep outside, but she doesn't mind that. And yeah, we also did, like, got a new bed because we needed one, and yeah. And it's really good for all of us. So, yeah. So yeah, we're finally in the spring months. <sighs> Hello, Cody. Hey, Maya. Happy birthday. <gasps> <laughs> oh, Cody. <laughs> I'm gonna turn around and I can give you your birthday gift. <gasps> okay. One, two, three. Cody! Oh my god! I love it! You haven't even seen it. Oh, what a beautiful dress, Cody! Oh my god! Happy birthday, honey. Thank you! Hi, Maya. Happy birthday, stepmummy. <gasps> Julia, thank you. <laughs> thank you. And Mila. Mom, thank you. You're welcome. After breakfast, we can head over. So, yeah, let's have a quick breakfast so we can go over to Elizabeth's house. After breakfast. Okay, let's head out. Okay, let's. Come on, guys. Let's go. We honestly should have just walk though. It's more easier. I know. And we're going to call you guys, too. Because, see, there it is all the way down there. And we have to walk this far. I know. Well, we probably should have walked then. I know. Okay, we can just pull in probably right here. Ooh, I hit her call. Just slightly though. Okay. And here's our latest creation mom. Or Elizabeth's mom. Wow! You guys built this? Yeah, we built ourselves a cabin because the boys will always want to see the Hollingers across the street. And since we're neighbors and have basically the same size yard, we agreed to build this and just shorten our servo yard. Oh, it looks wonderful! Yes, I think so, too. So, let's head in. Okay. Okay. Hello? Yes, totally. It's That was an awesome idea. Would well, you mind getting the door, um, Elizabeth's father, Peter? Um, since I... You know the drill. Yes, of course. Because we are back, I know, we have the same struggles now, ha ha. Ha 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 That was not that funny. Oh, I wonder who will be joining us today. Hey, Maya! Hi, Dad. Happy birthday, sweetie! Thanks, Dad. <laughs> Thanks, Dad, of course. Hey, Wiki. Hello. Perfect, we're all getting settled. Daddy. Yes, oh dear, oh dear. Daddy. Yes, Julia. Where's, um, Ben and Evan? Oh, I don't know. I think they're upstairs. Ben! 
Oh, that sounds like Ben. Excuse me, guys, where can I sit? Sorry, um, Maya, you know the drill about my back right now. Yes, I know. It's okay, I don't mind standing. Here, I'll just stand in the corner. So is Elizabeth coming down? Yeah, um, my mom's upstairs with Allison, but she'll come out with the boys. Come on, boys. Okay. Oh, that can only mean one person. <clears throat> oh my gosh. This living room is quite tight when everyone's here. And yes, I'm back in my nice outfit. Maya, happy birthday, little sis. Welcome to year 34. Thanks, Elizabeth. Of course, of course. Maya, of course. Ah, what are we doing today for your birthday? Oh, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> what do you mean you don't know? We came over for a birthday celebration. We already had breakfast. Well, yeah. We've just been busy with the cabin outside, but yeah, building that. But, yeah. <sighs> Anyways. <laughs> yeah? What's new? Kids, you guys can go along and play. Come on, guys. Coming, Julia. See you later, Mila. So what's new? Well, we got rid of Ben's bed because he fell off of it. What? What do you mean he fell off of it? Well, okay, the bed that was for Ben, but it was for both of them, actually. We got rid of it because Ben fell out of it. I mean, yeah. He's okay, but yeah. So we replaced it with bunk beds we bought for the boys, and they love him. Ben always wants to sleep on the top, but Evan says no, because he's a, a good big brother. Wow, and Wiki, how have you been with your surgery? Oh, you know, the drill. It hasn't been the easiest, but yeah, it happened on the 6th of March, and it's now the 3rd of April. Wow, so, you know, I can probably start walking if I try. Wiki, don't. But Elizabeth, yes, see? Whoa, Wiki! Oh, uh, see, you always fall over when you walk. Try again. Okay. Oh. Sorry, I'm just a little stiff. Oh. Good job. Yeah, he's been having to share the couch bed with my dad. No, my dad's actually been sleeping in my room, and he's been sleeping down here on the couch bed. Oh, very nice. Yeah, he got discharged around the 18th of March, so it's been a while. Yeah. Yeah, I had to stay in the hospital for a while, but Evan went home quicker, though. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, we... It was good that we had, like, the grand... Like, Ricky, your mom, came and helped the boys a lot, and Allison, while well, we could just go. The babies are growing up, though. Can you believe it? I know Mila's now seven months old, or will be seven months on the... 13th of April, and Allison, how old is she? Oh my gosh, she just is turning a few months old because she was born November 5th. So, January, February, March, April. She's turning five months old. Oh my god, she's five months old. Yeah, so, you know, well, she'll be five months on the 5th, but wait, today's the 3rd. Two days till she's five months old. <sighs> yeah. What's new, Cody and Maya? What about you guys? Well, we've been talking about things. We have been looking into buying a house, maybe. <gasps> Ooh! Yeah, well, we have made quite a bit of money off our apartment since we've been renovating it over the past seven months. But we're, we're thinking about moving. We're not saying for sure, but one day we're probably going to move from it. Maybe this summer we'll talk about moving. Because we we renovated a lot, we remodeled the master bedroom, we deleted the kitchen, we added a wall. You know, we did a lot of things that the previous people didn't do. Right. Okay, well, did you... When do you... Where do you think you'll move? Well, we're thinking on getting a house because Cody and I have only lived in an apartment, but a smaller one than the one we're in. And now this one, so we're looking to getting a bigger one. Like, we want to maybe move to a townhouse and then a house, but, yeah. Why a townhome? 
Why not just a house like this? I know, well, since Cody's a construction worker, he could, like, works in the construction industry. He could, um, always just buy us a lot. But we're just waiting till we're both financially ready. Because with my job and your job, and we want to, like, and if we buy a house, it would have to be outside probably the school district for Julia. But we haven't told Julia yet. No, because we don't want Julia to change schools quite yet. Because she's only five years old. I don't know how well she'll handle it. Well, yeah, she's literally a year younger than Evan. Well, I can't remember. Is she a year younger? Or is she the same age as Evan? Oh, yeah, they're the same age. I keep forgetting. They're, even, they're in the same class, I think, at school, too. Yeah, they're, they're both born in 2016. But she's five. She will be six. So I don't know how she'll handle going in. Well, she is starting first grade next year. I know they both are. That's crazy. And Ben is starting school. Yeah. But um, I don't know how she's going to handle that, though. The whole, like, if we change schools and then away from Ben and Evan... But Evan will won't have to worry about being alone, though, in that case, because, you know, Ben, I mean, Evan won't have to worry about being alone because Ben's going to be joining him. Yes, but Elizabeth, they won't be in the same class, though, because Ben's going to be with the JKs and Evan's going to be with the first graders. Oh, my gosh, that's true. <sighs> well, it's up to you guys. She, remember, she's five. She can't tell you what, what's happening. She's five years old. Yeah, that's true. So, you know, she she doesn't make the rules. You guys will. And if that and if the rules mean you guys are moving, then you guys are moving. I know we're gonna try to wait till maybe the summer to move or buy a house, but yeah, we just wanna finish out the school year with Julia at this school and stuff. Cause Mila won't be starting school for another few years. She won't be starting till like twenty twenty five because the girls are five years apart. Yeah, they are five years apart. Wow. Yeah, so she won't be starting for a while. In September, too. So by then, Julia will be in grade, like, four by then when she's starting. So, yeah. Yeah, for sure. And Evan, too. <laughs> Do you know what's funny, Maya? What, Mom? You and Allison look a lot alike when you were a baby. Really? Yeah. Hi, Allison. <laughs> Aw. She and Mila are going to be best friends, I'm sure, when they're older. Because they'll be the same age. Yeah, I know. Ben's the only one that doesn't have someone the same age as him. Ah, oh, it's so fun having kids at the same time. Why, right, sis? Yeah, we were even pregnant together, too, which is awesome. Well, this is your first child. Are you guys having any more? Maya and Cody? We've talked about it. Um, We maybe want to have one sooner rather than later. Ooh. Elizabeth, stop. We're not having one wait now, but we want to wait until Mila's at least a few months older before I think about having another one because we want to wait till she's at least one or one and a half before the baby's actually born. Well, and if the baby's going to be born, and then that also goes into our house too because then we'll have three kids. Well, no, this will be Maya's second, but my third, so yeah. Wow. You, but you guys are done, right? Yes, we three is enough. I did not even want to have a third. I was content with my two, but we had a third. <laughs> so, yeah. So you'd be saying like almost 2023 20, until that baby would be born. Exactly. It will be a while. So, yeah. Wow. <laughs> We're not telling Julia anything to get her hopes up. Well, Mila too, but Mila wouldn't understand. She might understand when the baby's here a little bit more, but she's still our baby, so, you know. But we're not thinking about kids right now, okay? We're, we're thinking about moving, but that has come into conversations between Cody and I. Oh, that's good. Nice room, guys. I like your bunk beds. Thanks, I got the top bunk. Why did you jump on there, Evan? That's not safe. Sorry, Julia. Wee! Ben, that's a baby toy. No, it's not, Julia. Ouch! It. Huh? Ouch! It. Ouch! It. See, we are too big. We both fall. Yeah, yeah, Julia. What? Who are these? They're mine. No, they're mine. No, Ben. They're ours. We share. <sighs> yeah. So I'm assuming your couch bed moved. 
Yeah, it's upstairs now, so why am I lying in bed? <laughs> it's upstairs now, Mummy and Daddy moved it upstairs, so... Yeah, why'd they move it? Well, because, well, and that was a pretty big bed, couch bed for me, and then we have bunk beds, so we decided to move it upstairs, and it's for Nana, my Nana now. What are you saying is for Nana, Evan? Oh, that couch bed, because you're living with us. That's true, guys, I am, I did move in with them. So yeah, I'm living here too now. Yeah, guys, I moved in too now. Oh yeah, speaking of moving in, Mom and Dad, what, girls? Um, so, Dad, are you living with us permanently? Since your mama divorced? Yeah, well, I'm planning on living here permanently. Oh, okay. Well, because if you guys were ever going to get back together, then you guys could buy a house or something or buy a condo together. No, I don't want to live alone. Yeah, and I don't, we don't, both don't want to live alone, and so this is better that we both live with each of our kids. So, Mom, you'd want to move in with us if we move to a bigger house like what we built here? Oh, yes, definitely, Maya. I'd love to buy a, live in a house like this one day. I mean, I know the apartment's nice and all, but I'm, I'm making it work. I, I'd rather want to sleep outside if that means I don't live alone. Okay, then. Let's just hope your goals for the future come true, Maya and Cody. Thank you. Bye! Happy birthday, Maya!